left out. I, was, I, I contacted him over and over. I was left hung out to dry. And by the grace of the Almighty, we prevailed. But yes, they that that was my crime. My crime was saying, now, I don't know if they were just threading me. I don't know if they were going to go through with it. But uh, I've, I've, I have, I'll tell you what I've done. I have tried to make sure that I walk the line when it comes to, okay, it's an election year. Uh I'll be careful, but I'm going to still talk about the issues. I got to. Uh, I think that what they did that day was, was unfair. I, I even said this to them and, and, and I, and I, and I'd like to get your thoughts on this. I said, uh, Kamala Harris went to Virginia campaigning in black churches at that, during that same time, telling people to vote for Terry McAuliffe. Mm. Did you, have you gone to those churches and, uh, and threatened them? <laughs> The answer was, well, we can't tell you <laughs> about other cases. Of course. You know? Of course. Well, we know that didn't happen. <laughs> so the, the government has been weaponized. It's, it's a, it's a tough pull. And you, you really have to trust the Lord because we're seeing today the unequal applications of our law. One man takes, uh, 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 certified documents. And the conclusion is he's too old. The jury will have, he can't, basically he doesn't have comp, the competence to stand trial. So we're not going to charge him without a dime being spent. The other man, I guess, I guess he's competent. <laughs> I guess his mind is strong because he's spending almost a hundred million in court after court for the same thing. America's in trouble. We got to be able to trust our systems. And, uh, but to answer your question, yes, they, they came, they came against me. And, and I told them, I said, uh, if you all don't want me to say she's bad for black people again, uh, I won't say that, but abortion is same sex marriage is. And I'm going to continue to champion that. And I will encourage people to vote their convictions. I've never told them how to vote. I never will. I think it's an insult to tell an adult how to vote.